It's a big woodpecker. He's pecking hard. Hello, hello. Ooh, that's a big woodpecker. I don't know about big, but he's pecking awful hard. I just got something up. Sound like it was down on that marsh, but I can't tell. The wind's blowing too hard. I just heard a, like something jumped up, but it didn't take off. Maybe I get up here. Yeah. Oh yeah, that water's up in there big time. Yeah, it's a big, uh, I keep saying big. That's a loud woodpecker. friend of mine lives over on the shore, eastern shore. He sent me a uh, couple pictures last night. He went out to, uh, there's an island called Estee Island. And, uh, apparently there's like 13 miles of gate that you go from gate to gate represents a mile they're a mile apart and there's 13 so that's 13 miles that you can walk not including that's just a straight run not including if you were to spread out and just go every inch of it lord only knows how much is there it's probably a few thousand acres maybe more but uh they went in, I think he said he went in for like four gates, four miles, and they snuck out, no, they, they weren't like sneaking around, he just, he said he snuck out on the beach, and was walking in the sand, and he said if it wasn't for the fact that it's cold, it's winter time, he wouldn't think nothing of it, but with it being so cold and so far out, four miles out, not in the area where people go ride, drive out onto the beach and camp. It's kind of out where nobody goes. He found foot you know, footprints of something with toes, you know, no shoes, no. And he, they measured the uh, the footprints. And uh, they were 16 and a quarter inches long. <laughs> And uh, like I think he said, four and three eighths wide. I said, my goodness, you know that's that's a big foot. There's that rock I put up there for him. Nothing else here. I don't see the peanut butter jar laying around. See at my place, if they take something, they'll bring it back. If when they're done, you know they'll bring the trash back. Here I haven't. I do find the remnants, the trash, and I do pick it up. And it's usually not far from where I put it. But anyway, yeah, he, he uh, they took measurements and so forth. And, and I meant to ask him because, and he probably doesn't mind, but I, I, he sent them to me, and I was just assumed that. You know, he sent them to me. I don't want to assume, though. That's one thing I won't do. But I assumed in the beginning that he sent them to me just to share. But I'm not going to do it until he tells me it's okay. He's supposed to give me a call this evening when he gets off work. 
But anyway, they found six tracks in a row, footprints in a row. And then they just, he said they just stopped. They didn't turn around, they didn't backtrack, they, you know, they didn't go up into the marsh reeds to where you couldn't, where it turned into grass. They were just walk, 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 you know, and then next thing you know, it just, that was the end of it. Uh, he said what was unique though about the, I think he said the left, the left side, the left uh, foot, it had a slight drag to it, like it was either limp or handicapped or it was injured, but it drug its big toe with each step. Not heavy, not deep, not gouges, but you know, it wasn't like dragging it deep in the sand, but it was just enough that he was creating a line. And it was just as straight as an arrow. He said it wasn't like it was, it, it was barely picking it up and like dragging it all over. It was just a straight, with precision, uh, drag mark, a line with the big toe. So I thought that was pretty interesting. But I will find out if it's okay to share them, because I, if I, if he says it's okay, I'm, I'm gonna put them up in the community, on my community page or tab, whatever you want to call it. Look at that. That's what I call. That's like a little seat. Guys, I'm thinking about if I get my hands warm enough. I'm thinking about. It going over there the next hill I haven't been over there in a while I usually stop when I get up here when I get up on around this bend that I always joke and kid about it being my favorite place and I just realized that I'm zoomed way in I'm using them out sorry um I usually stop when I get up on around this bend but I think I'm gonna if I can get warm, get my hands warm, warmed up, I think I'm going to go back further today. I'm trying to get this sun right and I can't see anything. This is where I always have the DMs really close to me. So, you guys, if you see anything, you know. You know the deal. You guys can timestamp it and we'll discuss it in the comments for sure. And uh, if you don't mind, hit that subscribe, like, and share for me. I really appreciate it. There's a lot of suspect things going on in here, though, like it always is. But, uh,. Yeah, this is definitely not a place I like too much. I usually don't even talk about it until I'm out of here. That's how much I don't like it. told me to look up. Walk up in here a little bit further. It just got eerie 